Yeah. Um, so guys, welcome back to part two of today's video. And just before we start on this walk and a hack with Liv and the dogs, shout out to Ollie Perry, who is really good at rugby, I think. Is he good at football, Liv? Good at football as well. So, shout out to him. Um, go to my sister's school. Right, let's shout out for today's video. And um, let's carry on. So, we're on with Liv. Liv, let's say hi. I'm not actually videoing you. I'm not going to video her because she doesn't like her face being on video. Liv, I tell you what, this is hard work without the tripod. Yeah, so guys, as I said in the last video, which is part one of this video, today's Saturday the 4th, but it's... Oh, I forgot my tripod and my drone. So that's a little bit of a... a little bit of a plava, really. But we'll get through it. And I don't know where... Liv, where are we walking? Yeah, so we're going to walk around the humpy, around the nine acres, and then we shall finish. Are you going through that gate, or do you want to go through the dry one up there? This gate. Oh. I'll keep the dogs back if you want. So, if you remember from the last part, I've got a lead, because Molly's in season, season, do you call it, in heat, in heat, um, which means... Yes. So she um so we're got leads. So if there's another dog, because she might go run new to it and start, you know, I'll say it's a scientific word, mounting it. She might start mounting it. So I'm gonna keep her on the lead. But if she's on the lead, Danny will stay. Um, well, that's what, just what mother and father do, isn't it? Look, mother and father. Hey, mother, son and. Mum. Yeah, son and mum. Um, that's what they do in it. So, and I'll show you right now the irrigator. So, if we can zoom this thing in. Come The irrigator's up there. Yeah. So that's the irrigator. Right now, Uncle Kev got a new phone, as I said in. Not the last part to this video, but like the last, the last video. Not the last part of this video. The last video, if that makes sense. Um, I told Uncle Kev got a new phone. That's what I'm videoing on right now. And if you remember from a couple of videos ago, we're moving the irrigator video. We're moving that irrigator. We moved it to over there, but it looks like they came back and moved it again I reckon um yeah and it's fairly wet if you can see my boots it is fairly wet um I don't want to drop the phone because brand new we got it on Monday the It was the 30th on Monday, wasn't it? Yes. 30th on Monday. And he got us on 30th. I'm pretty sure. We get on 31st. I ain't trying to turn sure, you know, but we're walking on. And Lib. I keep saying Lib. My name's Lib, not Lib. I say Lib. I don't know why I say Lib. Molly! Molly! I know you can probably sell sheep or whatever because we had sheep out on this ground. But Molly was walking the water trough because she's weird. Come on, Molly, don't be camera shy. Molly! Mush. Go on then. Go on then, pups. Oh, here we go. Let's count her in. She was. Yeah, she's I'm going to cut across because I can't be bothered to walk behind her right the way round. She's got to walk right round, 
No, not nine acres. Hello, Danny. Molly, come on. Molly. Lucky we shouldn't see any dogs out here. Should be alright because no one should be out here with dogs except for us. Us and people. And yeah, us because it's our land. My grandpa's land. But obviously we're allowed out in this land. This is ours, but it's actually not a footpath. Along the concrete road it is. Up the concrete road is a footpath. Look at that paddock. That paddock. That paddock and this and this paddock. I've never seen paddock field. So yeah, that field, that field and this field are all um or should be are all not footpaths. There's a hunting gear at the bottom there, but we barbed wired it up. I think it's been barbed wired and reopened. Which is slightly frustrating. Here we go. I'll show you what work the irrigator's done. It's blooming, yeah, it's blooming wet and whatnot, but it's all right. Look at this. I don't think I should be like that. Really wet. You can hear it. Liv, I don't think that should be like that. I think we're putting it on a bit too thick. How thick this slurry, this dirty water is. Isn't it? That'll be the sheep people who'd have that gate open, probably. You can hear it in the ground. You can hear the dirty water running through the ground. It's on a slope. Dogs, you can go for the hedge if you want, but I don't want you to get stuck. Here we go, this is a good example of how wet it is at the minute. How wet the gateways are. Liv, is it okay if I show like the back of you? Yeah, I've done that. Right, here we go. This is how wet it is. Dog paddling for it. And Liv's off. She's off. Go on, she's right at the top of the field, and I'm only at the gateway. But I'm going to go short diversion route. Go this way. I think that's very safe, you know. That'll be fine. I've got over a big lump of concrete. I remember in that corner over there, where that water trough is. I remember putting the pipes in for the water trough with my uncle and um, not Uncle Kev, not the Calmas General, but my other uncle who had a, who has a, who hired in a little digger. And what we did is we had to fill in there. It was like all muddy. We had to fill in the trenches, and um, I filled it in with a bit of like I had to. So he lifted that side, and then my and then the and then my uncle tracked it round, and I drove the digger on that side. It was the first time for me ever driving a digger, but it worked. Right, I got to navigate and live now. I hope she hasn't fallen off. I hope she's alright. But um, it goes over and it goes a little bit down, so I reckon she's just. Well, now go find her, and I might have to end this. But. Don't know, shall I do a part three? I might do a part three, but on the way home because I want to enjoy my walk with the dogs and not always be videoing. I don't want to video everything because it's not very exciting walking around the field. Anyway, over there, right, if you can see those houses. <clears throat> That is actually the mallards. Do you know what the mallards is? It's just, what is, they call it the mallards. It's called, actually called Cromwell Close. It's just a place, like a, what do you call it? A housing, what do you call it now? Yeah, it lives right, I can see. Um, house, uh, that's a housing estate. 
there's a housing estate near me. Um, so, I'll go show you this hunting gate down the bottom here. Yeah? Um, I'm doing this, I'm doing this video and showing you stuff and whatnot. I'm also keeping look on the dogs because I don't want them running away. I'm in charge of the dogs, not live. Oh, my school hall's up there at the top. I'll show you that. There. Yeah. There. 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 And the hunting gate's down. Got to find it now. Down there. But I'll go show you that. And then that's probably for this video anyway. Yeah, probably this video will be over after I show you this. Liv's walking up to it now. End this video. We'll walk back. I might video something when we're back at farm. Because there might be some more action going on. Because Uncle Kevin most likely be out. And so we'll... Um, Liv, you look like the hunt. Liv, I'm just going to show him this hunting gate. Right, come on, we're going to go around the railway. Round the railway, yeah? So Liv's going to go around the railway. I'll show you this, and I'm going to walk over to the railway. I'm going to show you this. I'm going to end this video, and I'm going to walk over to the railway. Anyway, there's marks here from where our contractor, Steve. So big shout out to Steve Howe, who does... Pretty much all our contracts and Ab Williams, um, who does our maze. But here's this hunting gate. Fairly old and battered, but people, you can get through there. Don't, Molly, Molly, Molly. <whistles> come on, dogs. Go on, go on, go on. Anyway, so you yeah, have the hunter coming today, so. But, Molly! Oh, gosh, she's having a... She's having a blooming poo. I don't have a poo bag on me. It'll be fun. <clears throat> Danny! Dogs, come on! Come on, dogs! Dogs! <whistles> Molly, Danny! Come on, then. Got to live. Got to live. Right, she's going to go around way away. And I'm going to end this video here. So from me and the dogs and that girl over there. Goodbye for now.